Let's go guys, this is Raul TV, your favourite YouTube mechanic back again and what I'm doing this time round is Team r ul we're going to do a Vauxhall Insignia 2010 Vauxhall Insignia headlight bulb Easy, easy bulb, let's do it <laughs> guys the first thing what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead go to this side I mean it's exactly the same on the passenger side I'm in the UK passenger side or driver side I'm doing the driver side the one next to the air filter box so I'm gonna go around this way take this plastic cover off anti-clockwise that comes off put that to a side and then the bulb lives in there it's unbelievable to show you guys it's absolutely buried in there but if you if I go in this way, you can just about make it out there. And what we're going to do with this bulb is we're going to twist it counterclockwise, anti-clockwise, and it'll come straight off. So we're going to put I'm going to put my hand in there. You can see my hand in there. Okay, and anti-clockwise, twist it. Boom! There you go. The bulb comes out. That's all you do. Once the bulb is out, it's absolutely plain sailing. We're just going to pull that bulb off. Can you see the pointer there on the top? Make sure the make sure the pointer lines up when you put the new bulb on, and uh, just refit it in reverse order. Let's go. Right there, we have it. New bulb. As you can see, there's a pointer right on the top there. This bit here against that lined up. Another top tip is make sure you don't touch, touch the glass when you're refitting it. If you do touch the glass, it will work, but obviously the life uh, expect expectancy will be a little bit low. Uh, it might not last you as long. So same way, we're gonna get my hand in there, put the bulb through, and all it is, we're just gonna go get it lined up in there. It's really hard to show you guys, but we're gonna get it in there and all we do clockwise this time. We took it off counterclockwise, anti-clockwise, and all we do is clockwise, twist it, and there we go, it's on. Happy days. Let's see if I can show you guys where the bulb is. Yeah, it's back on again. That's it. I mean, to make your life even easier, and if you want to go the extra mile, take the air filter box off, which is, it's not, ha it's not a hard thing to take off, but um, you don't need to. Uh, but if you do want to take it off, little socket there, seven mil socket on the Jubilee clip, take that off. And uh, that's about it. Basically, the air filter box will come off. Take that plug off. Air filter box comes off, and they can, you can go ahead and replace it that way. Anyway, let's try it. Let's see if it works. Forget. Make sure you put the cover back on. Uh, I mean, it's a good. I, 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 actually, what I would recommend it is you try it first, see if it works. Okay, then put the covers back on and everything, because it'll be an awful shame you put everything back on and find out it doesn't work. Right. So uh, maybe the bulb's faulty. Um, make, you can get bul faulty bulbs, so make sure you try it before you fit everything back on. Let's go. So that is it guys, that's how we replace the headlight bulb on a Vauxhall Insignia 2010, 11, 12 kind of thing. Dead, dead easy, same on either side, okay? All I'm gonna say is I hope this video helps you guys out. If it didn't help you guys out, I'm sorry, try my best. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell button for me. Leave a comment in the comment section, Raul TV, Team R for UL. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.